So I've got my backdrop built, and now I'm ready to construct a piece of text. So I'm going to go to the Create panel, and in the Shapes sub-panel, I've got Splines, and you will see Text is an object type. So I'll select that, and I can go ahead and enter in my text now, and choose the font, and then I can click in the viewport to create the text. I can actually put a carriage return in there too, put an enter, so I have a line break. And then I can choose any font that's installed on my Windows system. So I got some fun stuff in here. I'm looking for one I've got called Timepiece. And just click in the front view to create the text. And so now you see I've got a flat piece of text. It's just made out of splines. And as long as I haven't clicked off that object, I can play around with the parameters over here, like I can change the font and so on. The main thing I want to do is adjust the leading here to move them closer to one another. And I also want them to be centered. I've got kerning, which is the space between letters, too. You can play around with that. And of course, I've also got the overall size. So I'm going to make this something like about 5 feet. I can also, of course, go to the Modify panel and do the same. I can make it italic. That's a fake italic. That's just making it skewed over to the right. And adjust any of these parameters. So I've got some text, and next we'll add a bevel to it to make it 3D.